determining dysphagia with the subglottic secretion drainage system. Traditionally, speech pathologists use the modified Evans blue dye technique to detect and diagnose dysphagia. With this method, the balloon cuff of the tracheostomy tube is first deflated and then the patient is fed applesauce with blue dye. If the applesauce aspirates into the lungs of the patient, they are diagnosed with dysphagia. A catheter is then inserted all the way down into the lungs to aspirate the applesauce using a general purpose suction pump, as shown. This method is 50% reliable and requires excruciating bronchial aspiration. Using the new novel technique called the Gentile Green Dye Method, speech pathologists can now leave the balloon cuff in place, protecting the lungs, and safely place a drop of green dye at the back of the mouth of the patient or simply feed them applesauce with green dye. If the patient aspirates the applesauce, it accumulates above the balloon cuff and then is removed using the Cymex automated aspiration system as shown. This confirms dysphagia. The Gentile method is simple, safe, and easy to use to detect dysphagia without the need to deflate the balloon cuff or to perform excruciating endotracheal or bronchial procedures to remove secretions from the patient's lungs.